grapevine canopy management and its effects on bud fruitfulness. Achieving good yields in your table grape vineyard is important to your profitability and bottom line. This short Inno Grape video aims to highlight some of the important environmental and cultural factors that can influence the fruitfulness and yield in your vineyard. Did you know that this season's grape bunches were actually formed during last year's growing season? Because of this, it's important to understand the environmental factors and cultural practices that affect the formation of bunch primordia within grapevine buds. The grapevine bud is located in the axle of where the petiole is connected to the main shoot. This compound bud contains a primary bud and two smaller secondary buds. Under normal conditions, the primary bud emerges in spring and is typically the most fruitful of the three. Depending on the variety, the primary bud produces three to four leaf primordia and microscopic tissue called anlargan. The anlargan has the potential to produce either a bunch primordia or tendril primordia. The transition phase from anlargan to bunch primordia is called inflorescence initiation and occurs about 14 to 16 months before the actual harvest. In Sunraysia vineyards, the time is typically between mid-October to mid-December. The path to bunch or tendril is highly dependent on temperature and light. Studies have shown that when light levels are low in dense and shaded canopies, the formation of tendril primordia is favoured over bunch primordia, leading to less potential yield. In contrast, the number and size of cluster primordia increases with an increase in light and temperature, improving the potential yield. Canopy management practices such as shoot thinning, shoot positioning, basal leaf removal, summer hedging or trimming, and leaf removal after fruit softening or veraison are considered an integral part of growing quality table grapes because they reduce congestion in the fruit zone, increase airflow, reduce disease pressure, and enhance berry ripening and colour. But just as important, these practices increase light in the canopy interior improving bud fruitfulness and ultimately the yield of next year's crop. A table grape grower's ultimate goal is to improve profitability and the bottom line. This goal begins with proper canopy management techniques to promote bud fruitfulness and achieve good yields every season. This video is brought to you by InnoGrape, a table grape extension program supported by the Australian Table Grape Association with funding from the Foundation for Rural and Regional Renewal and the William Buckland Foundation.